My name go that black and when you see me, I'm white. <laughs> what's good y'all it's a girl and i'm back with another video period i'll be installing a wig okay i'll be installing the 613 the 613 wig that i got from um this website called all love hair i don't know that's what it's yes this hair i'm not even gonna lie it's super soft like when i tell y'all it's soft and there's no shedding unless like i drag my finger through it which i'm doing right now like if i do this like you feel what i'm saying nothing nothing but yes i did tone this wig down with the purple shampoo or whatever if you do hair or if you're a hairstylist you know what that is that is that's basically like a a, a toner for like 613 wigs and as y'all could see it is a 13 by 4 frontal and they said it was supposed to be transparent but y'all with the 613 hair i don't know if you could really i don't know like though i don't know how to explain it but the knots are definitely pre-plucked but with 613 hair you don't really gotta pluck it especially when they have like very thin hairlines like this you don't really need to pluck it but if you know it's like a really thick hairline you just gotta pluck that and make it look you know this is pre-plugged by the way and yeah this is 22 inches i don't know if this is really 22 this is given 20 but it's whatever y'all i just i got this like a few months back and i've been wanting to install this wig but i've been so lazy and i'm finally gonna install it it's gonna be like a i don't know like a wig install video i've never did one of these before and i am not a pro by the way I'm not a pro not but if y'all want to know where i purchased this wig or if you guys do want the do want to purchase this wig a 613 hair i'm gonna leave the link in my description box down below for y'all because you know i got y'all like that but i literally just washed my hair i didn't really wash it i just used some conditioner and washed it wash it out because it was like it had a lot of flakiness from the edge the gossipy that i used in my hair when i did that slick back so right now i'm just going to i let it air dry i don't want to road run a few errands came back and look at it right now I'm just gonna put this cash oil in there and I'm gonna use this leave-in conditioner. But you don't feel like doing it. And I got some hair clips from the beauty supply store, which I do need. So I'm gonna use like two. I'm gonna section my hair so I can detangle it. Where's my I got all the stuff that I need on my bed laid out? I'm not gonna show y'all because it's a mess. So we're not gonna show y'all. I got like my hot comb, flat iron, all the stuff that I need, you feel me? this white tooth comb was on the bed this whole time that's crazy but i do need to get my life together because i've been looking crazy all week like i don't know but as you can see the front of my hair looks pretty long like it's been growing because i did cut the front of my hair let me show y'all like y'all see that oh my god yeah if y'all don't remember i did cut my hair into some bangs or really short and look at this even the edges part well i did cut them anyways let's actually start braiding down my hair i'm not even gonna record that part because it's gonna be a long process of me trying to braid my hair down probably gonna record it probably not i don't know but yeah let me tell y'all how my life has been let me give y'all a little explanation because i know y'all a lot of y'all been watching my y'all are probably watching my videos or y'all are y'all are probably you guys are probably new to my channel you feel me and y'all are probably like i'm sorry what is this didn't she just have another channel yes yes i did and i did delete that channel well i didn't delete it i just removed all the videos because y'all because okay listen <laughs> so basically um when i um my hair is so thick but when i first started my channel like four years ago way back like let me tell y'all way back when i was in high school you feel me if y'all real supporters out there and y'all real ash mob y'all know that i've been started my channel when i was in high school and a lot of my high school friends high school you know schoolmates or whatever you call them they all subscribe to, or subscribe to my channel they're like oh my god i watch your videos i'm just kind of, uh. i felt so happy because it's like it's so crazy that people actually found my channel you know so 
yeah and i did do a few vlogs at school anyways that's not the point of what i'm trying to say what i'm trying to say is y'all are probably wondering like why did you make a second channel i'm gonna let y'all know right now so basically when i started my channel uh four years ago right i was you know whenever you start a channel you have to like sign up for google adsense once you have all the eligibility or can't say that word once you are eligible for monetization all that stuff you know to get like money or ads in your videos you feel me so basically you're supposed to sign up for google adsense put your tax info all of that your address your email everything in your google adsense and your channel link also right when i was doing that i didn't have like tax information because like i said back in high school i didn't um i started my channel back in high school and what you call it i um not have any tax information because i didn't have a job you feel me i did not start working until 2020 the same year i graduated from high school okay that same year i graduated from high school i got a job and i worked at jimmy jazz for a few months <laughs> and yeah that was that and i didn't really like i said i didn't have a job and once you do google access you have to put some type of tax information in so that you can get your payouts or so that you could get paid basically and y'all i didn't do that you know i didn't do that that was four years ago y'all four years ago wait i didn't start my channel back in high school but i started way back but the thing is i started posting more on my channel in high school yeah like i was saying when i first started i didn't add no um google I didn't have any tax information or anything like that because of me not having a job or whatever. And a lot of people, I know a lot of people that start their channel, they use their parents' tax information because, you know, they don't have a job or whatever. But I didn't want to do that because I wanted everything to be under my name and not my mom's or anything like that. And, um, yeah, so I waited until I got a job so that I could do my W-2s and all that stuff and, you know, put in my tax inf info on my Google Assets. So... <clears throat> I fast forward to two years later <laughs> or i don't even know how many years later but just fast forward to now you feel me now, when i first got the job i decided to just go back on google adsense and put it in and guess what happened i couldn't put it in because it was grayed out what i mean my grayed out meaning you can't click it like y'all if y'all are youtubers you know what i'm talking about like you can't click it you can't change you can't do nothing so i was like oh my god that means all this money i made i cannot get you feel me now i gotta really start over my channel like start fresh start over and y'all know this youtube stuff is not easy unless you have already have clout you know i don't really have that much clout but i worked hard for my subscribers on my other channel and i worked hard for everything and i was just like you know i'm gonna just start over because that money just go back go down the drain there's no way i could get it because i reached out to youtube help and all that stuff youtube support whatever the whatever it is you feel me i reached out to them and there were literally no help they kept telling me the same thing over and over but remember y'all there are like robots robots talking to you like trying to you know help you they're not actual people you feel me so i'm i was just mad because it's like youtube they don't have like customer service no nothing like a phone number to call so that in case a youtuber has problems with their stuff i don't even know y'all but basically i could not like do anything so i was just like you know what i'm gonna just start my channel over i'm gonna just start from scratch even though it's gonna be hard and you know i just have to work for it if i really want this you feel me be consistent and post good content you know and be as consistent as possible so that i could get back up there you feel me so that's what i'm gonna be doing y'all and just subscribe because subscribe <laughs> subscribe if y'all love me please i know i look crazy right now but don't mind that we we're getting it together we're getting it together i'm just detangling my hair we gonna get back to y'all okay i'm finally done detangling my hair so right now i'm just gonna do the whole braid and now process i'm not gonna do my braids my dookie braids or gel braids you know my meeks i'm not gonna do them like nice and neat but they're gonna be <laughs> somewhat neat so we're gonna do that i'm gonna come back to y'all i'm probably gonna record it i don't even know let's see what i decide to do because i look real crazy on camera <laughs> i didn't put that back on you see me i'm white i'll see i have to go put on some lashes because i look like i look very it's giving a 15 year old with a wig on but <laughs> my name called that black when you see me i'm white I don't even know if these are the same lashes. <laughs> oh my. I'm not just 
take this one off because this one is not matching up with this one. I'm like, honey, get into it. So right now, I just sprayed this on my bowl cap or whatever y'all call it, this wig cap. I braided my hair back all the way to the back. Mm -hmm. So neat, y'all see that period. And y'all see my girl in the back, ready to be on my head. So I'm just letting this dry for a few minutes and I got my glue that I got from Amazon, Bold Hold, Per. I'm just gonna plug my hot comb in and everything in from now. Let this dry. But yeah, this was supposed to be like a chit chat get rid of me for literally no reason. I'm just gonna keep for no reason. Literally just to go take some TikToks and make some videos. Cause what the f you know what I mean? <laughs> but I spilled water on my carpet, but it'll dry. I just sprayed, oh my god, this is messy. This lace tint that I got from the beauty supply store. Wait, let me see. As I can see. It's not even my like skin tone, I guess. I don't even know what the fuck, but y'all. Medium brown and the other ones are light beige and beige. I am not even I don't know if my scalp is beige or not, but yeah, I all right, so it's time to put this wig down. I should have, let's see how it looks. I think I should have put lace tint on it. What y'all think? Should I put lace tint on it? Shit, but the glue's already dry. I'm just doing a little bit because I don't want it to stain. And I'm gonna let it dry, hold on. Okay, so I'm scared. I am so scared. First, I'm gonna lay it down to where it needs to be. Look, I hate blonde hair sometimes. So much flyaways. Put it on my hairline or over the wig cap. I don't know. I did tone this wig down. I don't even know if this is even toned. Cause this look very blonde. I was gonna color it, but I was like, you know, let me just go blonde for a while. And then, you know. Bro, that's fine ways. Like, right? Okay, so first thing I'm gonna do before I cut the lace, I'm gonna let this melt a little bit. That's what they call it. I'll let it sink into my scalp, into the glue. So I can see the lace thing kind of came through on the one here, but it's cool. I guess. I don't know. Okay, okay, we doing good so far. Okay, I'm gonna put this up a little bit in the ponytail. I wanted to do like an ash blonde, but I was like, you know what, just. Do, do do just do it regular first because i don't want to mess this wig up after i paid like 180 something dollars because i did i had like a discount code or whatever got like 20 percent off because this is a transparent lace so yeah this pre-pluck like it's the pre-pluck the plucking don't look too bad like you might want so i'm just this shit got so much fireways bro we just lay this shit down. Can you stay back? Damn! Lay it right here. We're gonna let it dry. <laughs> okay, okay, it's giving scalp. Scalp. You feel me? Look at it. Look at it. Scalp. I didn't even pluck this, y'all, because. I was watching Aaliyah J's uh, like wig tutorials and stuff and she did this one blonde wig and she was saying basically um 613 wigs you do not have to pluck them because they already come some of them do come pre-plucked but like I said if they come with like a really thick hairline then obviously you gotta pluck it but this one as y'all can see is very like thin I guess I don't know but I'm just gonna cut the air part because yeah we gotta cut that you just want to measure it up because you don't want to cut too much. What the fuck? Mm. What is this? They got this big old... Oh, my God. I almost got the hair. I don't know what that is. Let's flip it up so I can see. 
but this is a whole band so how do they expect me to cut this like i'm so confused like the excess lace from here especially on the air part like i do not want i'm gonna go up some more so my ears can get some space damn Okay, this side, definitely gonna go up somewhere because y'all know I got my industrial. Oh my god, what the hell? What am I doing? I don't know what I just did, but I sure did just cut something. I don't want it to be too much down on my ears, like y'all been me. Like, y'all yeah, know I got my industrial. I don't want it to be bending my ears like that. I already got little ears. Okay. I'm going to spray some of this Even New York Wonder Lace Bond. Y'all know, like, the per perimeter of the lace area. And I'm gonna just tie back down so that it could melt. Scalp, y'all. The scalp. Yes. You wanna comb it into your scalp. This side looking a little, I don't know. But y'all, let me know in the section down below if y'all want me to do like story times. Cause I have a lot of story times, but it's like, I don't have nobody to talk to. Well, I do have people to talk to, but I'd rather keep them to myself. Cause why not? You feel me? <laughs> so okay, bro. My carpet is like gonna be so messy once I'm done. You know, lay a little bit. Yeah, yeah. All right, y'all. So as y'all can see, I already cut the lace and everything, and I kind of started flat um using the hot comb and everything on the the lace area, whatever to get it flat because it was looking kind of you know but now it's time for me to straighten it i did everything else off camera because i was on the phone with my grandma and i was just trying to do this so i could get it out of the way because i have stuff to do but i'm gonna do some sideburns and then we're gonna start straightening this because as y'all can see you know loving this already i don't think i'm gonna do any edges i'm gonna just leave it like this for now and then once i feel like i want to add edges i'm gonna do that later on you feel me but of course, I'm going to shadow sideburns or just leave it like this. I think I'm going to just leave it like that for now. You know, so I'm just going to go ahead and start straightening. This is giving scalp, as y'all can see. Period. So, for real. I don't know why this thing is texting me. Like, why are you, why are you texting me? Like, y'all. <laughs> She's talking about... I'm gonna add this high icy Fantasia hair polish or heat protectant thingy because y'all know 613 hair is very like you know has a lot of flyaways and everything and I want it to be real smooth and flat you feel me I got my flat iron here this shit is already hot I'm not a pro at flat ironing I'm gonna just do what I can it's getting already getting hot in here Yes, this strain is so good. Oh my god. And what I did with the lace, I didn't even put no concealer, no nothing. Because I did spray the lace scent on there. Remember, like I did before? And when I, when I part my hair, I pluck it. Like, part it, pull it. I saw that technique on TikTok. <laughs> like, TikTok be teaching me stuff. Like, I could really be a hairstylist at this point. But I'm just so lazy. I'm just stop being so lazy and stop playing with my potential like that's my huge issue that's my problem i don't even know how y'all section y'all hair off like how y'all do this like i can't just dab a little bit of this icy fantasia thingy i'm gonna do one section first like one side because i just it's almost nine o'clock it's time for my brother to go to bed and he don't want to go to bed but he's he gotta go like you got school tomorrow today is thursday y'all just in case so 
no i just uploaded a video of me doing a slick back i hope y'all enjoyed that video let me know if y'all really want me to do more natural hair videos like how do y'all feel like let me know i'm gonna put one side up like just put this shit away for now and we're gonna deal with one side just take out some thicker pieces i just don't want to mess the part up because it took me a while <laughs> to get it straight and in the middle okay this hair is really soft y'all even though i did shampoo it and stuff like that you don't see no purple no nothing like it's so smooth like i love this hair it's so soft I, they did want me to do like a review on this video on this hair so here it is i don't even know if y'all gonna see it but they said to post some videos or whatever and tag them and help so we gonna see like this i'm gonna give y'all the real truth raw and uncut and this hair is actually nice i'm not even gonna lie for a 613 hair it's really nice a little bit of this i could be soft and smooth no flyaways like y'all see, I don't even use no comb, no nothing to comb it out. I can use my fingers, like real smooth. This is not a what you call a sponsored video or anything, but you know, I gotta put some girls on out there. You feel me? Like this is a really soft hair. I don't know. It's this easy to straighten. I might give it some layers. Should I give it some layers? Yeah, I'm talking like I'm like I'm a pro. Like, girl, you don't even know how to put layers in a wig. But we gonna try. Like, I was watching um Aaliyah J's video with the layers, whatever, and she cut like downwards. So we're gonna attempt to do that and let's see. This video I already knows gonna be long, but I'm gonna cut it up because like who's really sitting there watch me ramble? Like what? <laughs> Like what, Ashley? But I know a lot of people like to watch, like to watch um wig videos and shit. <laughs> this is on the highest heat, like level, whatever they call it. Like, oh my god. My first time actually straightening a hair like on my head because normally I don't straighten wigs, I just be that shit. Is that bad? Like, I just feel like it's very time consuming to like straighten a wig. I'm not gonna put any on edges. Like I told y'all before. I'm just gonna touch this lace up. As I can see, I can see a little bit. So I'm gonna touch that up. Um, powder. True match powder. Is this concealer? Yeah, I don't know nothing about makeup. Makeup could only last so long, like it's not gonna last, you feel me? So we don't see how long this hold up. <laughs> okay, that, that looks fine. I'm gonna run through the hot comb, obviously, one more time. This hair is just so soft, like, Oh my god. Period. Now I'm gonna do this side. I'm gonna come back to what I'm done because I don't have time. Okay guys, so look, I'm finally done straightening. So now I'm just gonna go in with the hot comb again. But first I'm gonna use the wax stick that I have, the Care Care wax stick. I'm actually loving this. 
not too much because i don't want it to look i don't know this should not even mm. This hair is just so smooth. Oh my God. Now I'm just going to get cute and take some videos and pictures on TikTok. <laughs> oh, no edges, cause I don't want to mess it up. I really don't. Like it's giving scalp. Scalp, I tell y'all. That's what y'all was gonna do layers, but I really don't want to mess this wig up. Like, if I F it up, it's over with. <laughs> it's just over with. I could put it behind my ears, wherever. I'm just waiting for the hot comb to get hot. Okay, it's a little hot. Okay, I'm gonna put this one behind my ears a little bit where my industrial is and just kind of like pull this down. You feel me? Yes. With no edges, super cute. Put this one back and let's see. This is giving scalp. This air is like, I don't know. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Period, I did that. Period. Y'all didn't, y'all didn't tell me I didn't F it up. Like, I can really install y'all wigs for y'all. Period. Only thing, my ears are just so small. Like, they're not gonna hold the hair. <laughs> but... That's it, that's all. So I am finally done installing this because y'all can see it came out really cute. I love it with no edges. I feel like it looks so natural. You feel me? And I keep saying you feel me. I need to stop saying that. I got a bad habit. But there's like hair everywhere in my room, <laughs> which I'm not gonna clip right now. I hope y'all enjoyed this video of me uh, giving a little story time or just like a chit chat, get ready with me just to like, you know, y'all saw how I looked before at the beginning of this video. And now y'all see me like, a baby, a baby, period. So I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Give it a big thumbs up if y'all did. If y'all want me to do more hair videos, wig installs, whatever it is, let me know in the comment section down below. And I got y'all. And make sure y'all subscribe to be part of the Ash Mob, period. Make sure y'all turn post notification bell to be notified whenever I post a video. Follow me in all my social medias. It'll be on the screen somewhere and description box down below. And I'll see you in my next video. Y'all stay blessed, stay positive, and never depressed, period.